This is the World of Tanks tech tree for version 1.5.1. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go through the tech tree and I'm going to go through every tank and all the, the branches and I'm going to tell you which tanks I think are really cool and which ones really suck. Uh, so let's start with the Americans. You know, first I'm going to go through the overall. I think the Italians, the upper tier Italians are really good. Swedish, they got a lot of great tanks in there mixed around. I think that the top Polish tanks are pretty cool. Uh, Chinese, they've got some good tanks in there, they, but they do tend to s set on fire. The light tanks, the premium light tanks are cool. You might, If you like light tanks, you might like the Chinese. You might like the medium tanks. Uh, the tank destroyers, I enjoy playing. Japanese heavy tanks are fun to play. Uh, you might like the medium tanks. Um, Czechoslovakia. This TVP uh, uh, 5051 is an awesome tank. It's one of the top tanks in the game. The rest of them I really didn't care much for. French tanks, bottom tier, like 1 through 4 or 1 through 5, all crap. Higher tier, all fun to play. British tanks, the medium tanks are really cool. Heavy tanks. We got a situation here where the medium tanks are slow to reload, do more damage, and the heavy tanks, fast to reload, do less damage, which is the opposite of a lot of tanks. I loved playing the Tank Destroyers, one of the top players for the AT-15A. Um, these Tank Destroyers, I don't have great games. I don't have high win rates, but I enjoy playing them. And the SPGs I like to play. Their SPGs are actually pretty cool. Uh, is this Russia? So... The Russian tanks, they've got a mix. They've got some that are a pain, and they've got some that are really cool. It's kind of all mixed in. There's a lot of diversity. There's a lot of really unique tanks. Germany in general, good for sniping. Super heavy tanks, good for Germany. Um, great tank destroyers. Uh, SPGs are not that fun. The, the Russian SPGs are not that fun. The light tanks, I would say painful in general. Uh, the lower tier, like the Tier 2, for example, German tanks and Tier 3, are some of the best in the games. The, lo the lower tier German tanks are really cool. Americans, kind of the same. I think America is a really well-balanced tech tree. I like the SPGs. I like the light tanks. I like the medium tanks. I like the heavy tanks. I like the tank destroyers. In general, I enjoyed probably every uh, tree on all the branches. So now let's go through the premium tanks. I own all the premium tanks that are in the tech tree. Uh, I'm talking about in the in-game tech tree. So the T2 Lite, um, I think it's okay, I guess. I, I really don't remember if this is the really good one or the really crappy one. Locust, I love to play the Locust. If you like to spot, the problem is, is the view range is really not that great. And it doesn't have a lot of ammo. So you could easily, I run out of ammo with that. The Scorpion, I think it's fun, but it's a difficult tank to play. You really got to be careful playing a scorpion. Your allies are going to be one of your biggest threats. They're going to ram you at the beginning of the game. T26 E4, this is the first premium tank I ever bought. And uh, it's a well-rounded tank. So you might have good games with it, and it's kind of cheap. T34, I, I kind of liked that this was a powerhouse when I first started playing. However, nowadays, I really am not that crazy about it anymore. I don't like to play this tank. But it's got its uses. It's got its features. The armor and the gun are really good. T92, I absolutely love this tank. This is one of my go-to tanks. This is one of my top, you know, out of, there's like 400 tanks. I got 154 tanks. This is one of my top 5 or 10 tanks in the game. So we're going to continue talking about premium tanks. This T-15, nothing special. The S-35 is actually one of the best tanks in the game. It's a French tank. I love playing the S35. It's got one of the highest win rates, I believe. This T25 is not that great. I actually think it has the highest penetration for Tier 5, but I'm not sure. Dicker Max, I get crappy games, but I like playing it. This Styre, I don't like that style of tank. I hate playing it. The Tiger, I like playing it. 
this had a long learning curve. At first, I hated it, uh, but after a while, I learned how to play it. Uh, these It shows that I don't own these tanks, but I used to own them, and I sold them. Panther M10, I did not like it, sold it. VK4503, didn't like it, sold it. In fact, I seem to recall this was really a garbage tank. They might have... Uh, they might have buffed it, so maybe it's better now. Panzer Mutz, I enjoyed it at first, but after a while I hated it. It had low win rate. The Panther 8.8, um, didn't really like it. The low, I had the low, and didn't really like it. It's good for sniping. In general, German tanks good for sniping, but lots of problems. This thing, garbage tank, probably. The Valentine, I actually had good games with this. And the Churchill 3, I love the Churchill 3. This is one of my killer tanks. If we're playing Tier 5 and you see me roll out with the Churchill 3, run and hide. Uh, Matilda 4, a killer tank. Other people don't like it. I am awesome in this tank. I am one of the top-ranked players in the Matilda 4 and the Churchill. su 100 why I like this tank. It does a lot of damage. I get good games. Some of my best games were in this tank. T3485-M. I believe that other people like playing this tank. I don't. I like playing this style of tank destroyer, the SU-12244. Uh, T54 Mod 1, I had it and sold it. But there's other people that really like it. IS-6, I think, is garbage. It used to be a decent tank. Uh, it's got a weak gun. Uh, there's so many tanks that are better than it. It used to be, almost, it used to be the second worst uh, after the 112, but they buffed the 112. KV-122 is a crappy gun. I should sell it. STG, okay, this is a tank I've never played, never owned. However, I have high win rates in rear-mounted turreted tanks. Can't tell you about that one. UK, <clears throat> Matilda BP, I love this tank. I'm a top-ranked player. Excelsior, I'm a top-ranked player with Excelsior. I love that tank. AC4, I'm one of a uh, top-ranked player. 1815A, I love this tank, top-ranked player. I, I do good with this tank. I like this tank. AMX M449, I believe it's a well-armored tank. Uh, but I don't play it that much. M4A1, I don't think it has a strong armor, but I guess the gun is pretty good. The CDC, I really don't play it very often. It's big and fast, but being big is the problem. Uh, the CDA-105, that's a great tank. It's got a pretty good penetration. I like playing the AMX CDA. Skoda T40, don't like. Chinookai, at first I didn't like it, but after a while I really started to like it. Uh, the heavy tank number one, which is like a tiger, don't like it, hate it. STA two, I really did like it. It's it's actually it's a tank that I don't play very often. I'm not I like other tanks more than this, but it's not a bad tank. It's actually a pretty good tank. Love this tank. Type sixty four is awesome. Uh, this I okay. Here's a tank that I never owned, and I thought about buying with the trade in. The thing is, I'm just not going to play it. I've got too many tanks. So I couldn't justify spending like 15 bucks on it or however much it's going to cost me uh, with the trade-in. But I would enjoy it. I like these series of tanks. The 112 used to be the crappiest of this style of tank, uh, but they buffed it. 59 Patton, really don't like playing that. Uh, the Poodle, okay, here, so here's another one I didn't buy. However, it's similar to the Panther, and I don't really enjoy playing the Panther. But I did get the hang of it after a while. This I like playing, but it's not the greatest tank. I believe that this might actually be one of, one of the highest rated tanks in terms of win rates. I don't get good games out of it. It is an autoloader, but I don't like the fact that it's a little slow. Uh, then we've got uh, the Progetto, which is not here, but the Progetto is one of the best tanks in the game. <clears throat> so 